It's nearly Christmas. It's pretty cold. There's not a lot of sunshine. And all around Hong Kong, people are heading out to family dinners, especially to have hot pot. But why is this happening? The answer has got something to do with the sun. You know all about the seasons, spring, summer, autumn and winter. And you know that different things happen in those different seasons. Summer is hot, trees lose their leaves in autumn, and winter, which is the season right now, is cold. The different seasons are caused by the sun and the way the earth spins around the sun. So the earth goes around the sun in a giant circle and the time it takes to get all the way around once is called one year. You also know the earth spins around on its axis and once around this is called one day. Now, if you imagine that my fingers at the top and the bottom of the earth here are connected by a line, this line is called the axis and the time it takes to do one turn is one day. The thing is, the earth's axis is not dead straight to the sun like this. It's actually at an angle. This means that Hong Kong is a little bit closer to the sun for half the year and a little bit further away for the other half as the earth spins around the sun. You can easily see that there is less sunshine during the winter and more during the summer. The day when we are absolutely the furthest away from the sun is called the winter solstice. It is the shortest day of the year and it normally happens around the 21st of December. So what does that mean for people in Hong Kong? Well, it means being on a bus with a load of heavy bags and going to see the family, or at least that's what it means for my family. Winter solstice, or Dongji, is a traditional Chinese festival marking the middle of winter. Actually, many people around the world mark the middle of winter. It's a time when they might need to be careful of how much food remains for the long, cold, deep winter of January, February and March. But it's also a time to celebrate that winter is half finished and every day will get longer and have more sunshine as summer approaches. So, if it's such a common thing all around the world, then why don't more people celebrate it? There's a pretty simple answer to that too, and it is Christmas. Some people think that in Europe, the traditional winter solstice celebrations were simply pushed back a few days and became Christmas celebrations. That's why we have feasting, singing and decorating trees. So whether you are celebrating winter solstice, Christmas or any other festival at this time of year, have a lovely holiday and I will see you all in the new year.